All right, gaming explorers, today we dive deep into the high seas adventure that is Mario Luigi Brothership. What if I told you that our beloved plumbers are taking on their most ambitious RPG journey yet? Get ready for a world of nautical chaos, brotherly humor, and a story that will keep you grinning from start to finish in this review. We'll break down everything from gameplay mechanics to visual spectacles, and yes, even the puzzles will keep things spoiler free, but packed with all the info you need to decide if this game is worth your time. And hey, you might even laugh at Luigi's expense. It's practically tradition stick around. You don't want to miss our verdict on this oceanic escapade. Who knows? You might find yourself in stitches or just wishing you had a ship to sail ready? Let's jump right in and explore this adventure, mateys. So what's the plot this time? Mario and Luigi are on board a magical cruise ship and naturally things go hilariously wrong. They're drawn into a world of mischief, sea creatures, and a quest that goes from whimsical to genuinely intense. Each location has its own charming narrative and new characters to fall in love with or to fear, but don't worry, the brother's humorous banter is always there to lighten the mood. The writing strikes a fine balance, offering heartfelt moments that add surprising depth. And just when things seem calm, bam, another surprise plot twist keeping you hooked. How does this all stack up compared to past adventures? Let's keep sailing to find out. Just know that the stakes here feel refreshingly unique, but is the journey smooth? Or are there rough waters ahead? More on that in just a bit. One of the game's strengths is the lovable chemistry between Mario and Luigi. Mario is still the heroic, brave one, while Luigi remains the lovable goofball we all cherish, but this game gives both characters more depth. Especially when their brotherly bond is tested, interactions are genuinely heartwarming and hilariously awkward. At times, expect lots of situations where Luigi's fear gets the better of him, and Mario has to play hero supporting characters are equally memorable. Each adding a layer of charm to the world from quirky sailors to mysterious ocean spirits, the cast is diverse and engaging voice work and expressions bring these moments to life in a way that's a delight to watch. However, do all these characters serve a purpose or do some feel like filler? We'll explore that in our analysis. Now let's talk mechanics. This game mixes traditional turn-based RPG elements with real-time twists. Each brother has unique abilities that must be mastered to succeed in battles. Combat is far from simple button mashing. Timing and strategy play a huge role you'll dodge, counter, and chain special moves, making every fight feel dynamic and rewarding and customization also adds depth, letting you tailor abilities to your playstyle. Whether you want to boost Luigi's quirky luck or Mario's strength, the choices matter how well do these systems hold up over the game's long runtime. Stick with us and we'll dissect whether the mechanics are genius or overcomplicated. One thing's for sure, mastering each move feels incredibly satisfying and trust me, you'll need all the skills you can get. Ah, the puzzles. If you enjoy brain teasers, this game will be a treat. Every puzzle uses both Mario and Luigi's abilities creatively, you'll need to think on your feet. As the game cleverly intertwines combat and puzzle solving, there are moments that make you feel like a genius when you figure things out, but fair warning. Some puzzles can be pretty challenging. Expect to experience that classic facepalm moment when you finally get the solution. Do these puzzles add to the fun or slow down the pacing? We'll unpack that soon, so stay tuned either way. They keep you on your toes and break up the gameplay nicely if only solving real life problems were as satisfying. Exploring the world in Brothership is a feast for the senses from glittering underwater cities to eerie shipwrecks. Each setting feels unique and full of surprises, hidden paths and secret areas reward curiosity. So take your time and soak in the sights. The game strikes a balance between linear progression and exploration so you never feel lost. Some areas even have dynamic weather. Adding to the immersive experience NPCs you meet along the way have hilarious one-liners and useful hints, but here's the question. Does exploration ever feel tedious or repetitive? We'll weigh the pros and cons of this aspect soon for now. Just know that getting lost in this world is more pleasure than pain. Let's hope you have a strong sense of adventure. Combat in this game isn't just about hitting buttons. It's a test of timing and tactics. Enemies have unique attack patterns, so every battle is a fresh puzzle to solve. Switching between the brothers and using their abilities efficiently is key. The game even throws environmental hazards into the mix, like waves or crumbling platforms, and yes, you'll need to master some special moves to conquer the game's challenging bosses. Every hit feels impactful, especially when you perfectly time a counterattack. Is this system engaging or just a way to make you sweat? Stick around, we'll dive into the nitty gritty soon, but for now, let's just say Luigi scream attack. Absolutely legendary, trust me, you'll laugh. Speaking of laughs, humor is woven into the fabric of this game. The jokes range from clever wordplay to slapstick moments that are pure gold watching Luigi panic or Mario roll his eyes never gets old. Even the enemies have amusing quirks that'll catch you off guard, dialogue is snappy. And each character has their own brand of humor. There are even moments where the game playfully breaks the fourth wall, but is all this humor enough to keep things feeling fresh? We'll discuss that in our overall impressions for now, just know that the comedic timing is almost always spot on laugh or groan. Either way, it's an experience. The soundtrack of Mario Luigi Brothership is nothing short of spectacular, upbeat tunes accompany you on fun adventures. While dramatic themes kick in during battles, there's a mix of orchestral pieces and playful tracks that add to the game's charm. Sound effects are equally impressive. From Luigi's frantic yelps to the crunch of well-placed attacks and the ambient sounds, they pull you into the world, making every setting feel alive, but does the music ever get repetitive or overwhelming? We'll touch on that soon in our verdict for now. I can confidently say this soundtrack slaps if you don't find yourself humming along. We'll be shocked because who knew the ocean could sound this epic? Visually, Mario Luigi Brothership is a vibrant treat for the eyes. The art direction stays true to the franchise's roots 
While pushing boundaries with oceanic themes, characters are animated with exaggerated expressions that never fail to make you smile. The world feels alive with bustling ports. Glowing coral reefs and spooky shipwrecks, even small details like how Luigi's mustache curls when he's scared. Add charm color palette shift to match the mood from bright and whimsical to dark and foreboding. Are the visuals enough to leave a lasting impact though? We'll address that shortly in our overall impressions. One thing's for sure, the game never looks boring. It's a visual spectacle that's as fun to watch as it is to play. Before we go any further, let's cover where you can get your hands on this adventure Mario Luigi Brothers ship is available exclusively on the Nintendo Switch whether you're a fan of handheld gaming or prefer dock mode the game runs smoothly, the graphics and performance hold up impressively. Even during the most intense scenes, load times are generally quick, making exploration seamless and frustration-free multiplayer elements work well, so bring a friend along for some co-op action, but is the Switch hardware enough to do this game justice? We'll examine that in our technical breakdown soon, just know whether you're on the go or at home, you're in for a polished experience, but hey, a Mario adventure on any platform is always a welcome sight. Let's get hands on the controls and Brothership are intuitive and responsive, both Joy-Cons and the Pro Controller offer smooth gameplay without any noticeable hiccups, the game is full of quick time events that are easy to learn but hard to master there's an option to remap controls which is a blessing for accessibility new players will appreciate the forgiving tutorials while veterans can jump right in however some mechanics require precision that might frustrate casual gamers does this impact the fun factor or accessibility of the game stick with us we'll give you the full scoop in a bit for now rest assured that mastering these controls feels rewarding if only real life plumbing were this simple now is mario luigi brothership worth multiple playthroughs the game boasts hidden secrets alternate dialogue paths and collectible treasures completing all side quests gives a sense of accomplishment and adds hours to the experience plus there are difficulty settings for those who crave an extra challenge but does replaying feel fresh or like a chore we'll analyze this shortly for now know that the game does incentivize exploration with meaningful rewards achievements and easter eggs are sprinkled throughout encouraging thorough play and for you completionists out there this game is a dream or nightmare it's definitely more than a one and done experience trust me but let's see if that's enough to justify a full second voyage side content and brothership is like a box of chocolates delightful and unpredictable mini games range from fishing tournaments to cart races breaking up the main quest nicely some side quests add depth to the story, while others are just for laughs, Luigi even gets his own hilarious side missions. Often involving some sort of mishap, do these activities add value or feel like padding? We'll discuss that in our pros and cons either way. They're a blast to complete and provide a nice change of pace, the variety is there. But some mini games can feel overly simplistic still. They contribute to the game's overall sense of fun and whimsy completionists will have plenty to sink their teeth into if only real life quests were as entertaining as these. Combat isn't just a button mashing ordeal, it requires careful planning and strategy. Each enemy has distinct weaknesses, so adapting your tactics is crucial. Mario and Luigi have unique skills that complement each other, making team dynamics essential boss battles in particular, are thrilling and test your mastery of the game's mechanics. Items like power-ups and gear upgrades keep things interesting and customizable. You'll constantly be on your toes. Switching strategies mid-battle to counter foes. Does the depth of combat keep the game exciting or just make it harder? We'll explore that in more detail soon, so stay tuned. There's a lot to unpack, but combat here is nothing short of exhilarating time to channel your inner tactician and lead the brothers to victory. Enemies in Brothership are as varied as they are creatively designed from mischievous sea creatures to magical pirates. You never know what's lurking around the corner. Each enemy type brings its own set of challenges and attack patterns. You'll encounter everything from comically weak minions to bosses that genuinely test your skills the design isn't just aesthetic, it directly impacts gameplay. Keeping you engaged, are some enemies overly frustrating or unbalanced? We'll dive into that in our impressions for now. It's safe to say, expect the unexpected, and yes, some creatures are so bizarre you'll be laughing mid-battle. This enemy diversity adds richness to every combat scenario. Just remember to always be on guard. You never know when a goofy enemy will strike. Balancing humor and storytelling is no easy task, but Brothership does it well. The plot never feels bogged down. Even during more serious or heartfelt moments, Luigi's comedic timing is impeccable. Serving as the perfect foil to Mario's seriousness, even minor NPCs get their share of witty dialogue that'll keep you entertained, yet the story still manages to deliver emotional beats that pack a punch. Is it all jokes and laughter, or does it offer something more more meaningful. We'll weigh this storytelling style in our final thoughts, but for now, it's clear the narrative is more than just a backdrop. It's an emotional roller coaster sprinkled with humor, much like life itself, so grab a tissue for your tears, both of laughter and genuine feels. Clocking in at roughly 30 to 40 hours, the game's pacing is impressively balanced. Main missions are well-paced, but side content is where things can get a little bloated still. The game never feels like it's dragging on unnecessarily. There's always something new to see or do. Keeping the adventure fresh some moments might feel like filler, but they're few and far between. Does this game respect your time? Or does it overstay its welcome? We'll cover that soon, rest assured though, the adventure feels worthwhile. You'll be too busy exploring, laughing, and battling to notice any slow spots, and if you need to take a break, 
It's easy to pick up where you left off, so buckle up. This is a journey you'll want to savor. All right, let's break down the pros and cons in a bite-sized list pros, charming story, incredible humor, and dynamic combat that keeps you engaged. The visuals are stunning, the music is top-notch, and the game is packed with secrets to discover accessibility options and customization features make it welcoming for all players. Luigi's character development, absolutely delightful cons. Some puzzles can be overly challenging, and a few side missions feel repetitive. Certain enemy encounters might frustrate less experienced players. And yes, there are moments where the humor overshadows the serious plot overall, though. The game delivers a memorable and mostly balanced experience. Let's move to our final thoughts and see how everything comes together. In the end, Mario Luigi Brothership is a high seas adventure worth embarking on. It captures the magic of the Mario universe while offering something new and refreshing you'll laugh, you'll think. And you'll probably scream with Luigi at least once if you love RPGs or are a longtime fan of the series. This game is a must play, but even newcomers will find plenty to enjoy. Thanks to its accessible gameplay and humor, so would you set sail with the brothers? We'd love to hear your thoughts. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe for more reviews like this one. And hey, why not check out our video on Slitterhead? Trust me, it's a wild ride. Click the link in the end screen, and we'll see you there. Thanks for watching, and happy gaming, adventurers.